and joins Lionel Messi there in MLS. No surprise there. Yeah, listen, Messi gets what Messi wants, huh? Let's yeah, see. No. Let's see who else is going to join. Exactly. Played against him one time. Maybe he wants me. I don't know. <laughs> no, it's. Did um, you play against him? Yeah, I played against him once. Yeah, once. It just he was in a. He was basically in a preseason game, but it just it felt surreal. I played against him for City in 2009 I think it was at the new Camp and we won 1-0 and we never crossed got out of our half the whole second half it's the biggest robbery you've ever seen in your life <laughs> but yeah it, it, Sergio Busquets is an Inter Miami player it's not a sentence I thought I'd ever hear in my lifetime but then again it's then it follows and joins Messi there but this is the thing about the MLS it feels it, the, the place it's a gift and a curse in terms of how the think place works because everything they could change the rules every year if yeah. they want so that can be a positive. Sometimes when you play in it, it feels like a negative, but then it grants you the opportunity to sign two players that have been some of the greats of their generation. So good luck to him, but I can't imagine the fact that those two players are now officially going to be playing for the worst team in MLS. I know, they are. Let's remind everybody, they are the worst, the worst team in MLS. worst team in MLS. Yeah. And I'm just trying to think, well, the league obviously wanted him to sign. The other clubs have tried to get him to sign. Well, how's it going to look when Messi's like doing nothing? Like, oh, Busquets is doing nothing. Like, I hope they can buy into it yeah. and what it means and what they mean for the league. But at some point, football has to be a priority. And I think they're going to be in a, somewhat of a tough situation. I mean, I think, say. you know, for Busquets and, and Messi is going to be an inspiration, I think, for, for generations in, in the US. Great. I think Busquets, if, if, again, if he plays well and not have like a PLO esque experience, that kind of stuff. But there's one quote. That I just wanted to say on the show about Busquets that Vicente del Bosque said. He used to say, if you watch the game, you don't see Busquets. If you watch Busquets, you, you see, see the, the whole game. game. Yeah. And I think this is so perfect. Oh, okay, now he's 34. He's, he's never been quick, but he's even slower now. But the football IQ will still be there. So I hope that he's still good enough, like yeah. you said, <laughs> to inspire some kids in the US or whatever age you are in the US to just watch him play, whether you watch on TV or just go to the game. And just and just see the game the way he used to see. I, or I think himself it. and Messi will really benefit the players that are around them. I think they'll benefit yeah. the ones who play against them like a few times in the year. But the reality of it all is like that star power that's been brought to the MLS. If it brings more American eyes to watch the game, they might not necessarily notice the details true. that define how true. good Busquets is. Yeah, yeah, true. I hope they can find a way. But then also, like respectfully, again. The players that those two will be playing with now will be the worst players they've played in probably since they're in the That's academy. That's the thing. Because if I'm Busquets... And it's not right? saying they're bad players. No, 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 no. But if I'm Busquets, I've got the ball. The space is here. If you don't see the space and don't move into that space... I'm going to tell you to go there, but you might not understand why. Yeah, but for all Busquets I am, if you don't go there, I've got nowhere to pass the ball in what I think is the right space. Yeah. And that's why they still very... And same for Messi. Yeah. That's why they will still be very dependent on who plays around them. Yeah. They need to... It's more than just those two pieces that will define a team, yeah. especially in the MLS, because the difference between those two... And then someone on the field who was at college six months ago. You know, that's not necessarily <laughs> going to bring out the best of Messi, is it? Surely Let's just not. say that. Surely not. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.